Welcome back. Once you have uploaded your video, what you're going to do is you're going to come back to your profile. You're then going to go back to your creator studio. And then once you've gone back to your creative studio, you're then going to go to this channel area. It's going to open up a new dialog box on the left hand side and you're going to see that you're going to be in the status and features area. Now, once you've uploaded your video, you should be eligible to upload videos. What you want to do then is you want to then click this button to enable live streaming. So you're going to click this button. What's going to happen then is that Google is going to verify your identity through your mobile device. Now you can in some cases have multiple accounts. So just so that you'll be aware, you should be able to go through this account verification process if you have another account associated with your mobile device. What you're also going to want to enable are going to be longer videos. Since your streams will likely be longer than 15 minutes, you want to click this enable button. And again, if you haven't gone through the verification process, Google will take you through that verification process at this point. But there are other features that you are going to want to enable. Custom thumbnails, external annotations, and custom URLs. That may take time and a few videos for you to have uploaded. However, as soon as these are going to be eligible to you, you want to make sure that these are going to be enabled because they will help you in promoting your live stream. But once you've enabled everything necessary for live streaming, your area should look something like this. Okay, so with that, thanks, and I will see you in another video.